Hello everyone, Cesare here with more Final Fantasy XII. Uh, that said, uh, we are here in the Western Sand, and if you recall, we ended up in the Sand Sea. I did a little bit of uh, exploring to see if it was a good place to level. It would have been, but there's a cutscene. So, I opted to just go somewhere else. That said, there's a treasure chest over here. Let's go pick that up. There we go. What I like is that's actually sand, not water. Pretty cool, though. But I like the music here. I like the atmosphere. It's all kind of cool. There's owl runes. One moment. Randomly, someone placed a trap back here. Fuck you, Alvin. <laughs> I I strongly see a lot of the uh, similarities between. Star Wars and FF12. All right, so these were these things here were treasure chests. Um, all they had in them was the maps for this place and the next part of the sand sea. Fighting the Aurans. What are you doing, Packament? Oh, cool that is. Like an oil rig or something. Oil refinery. Construct to draw oil from the ground. Abandoned many years now, it seems. Did Dalmaskins build this? No, the Rosarians. Their empire lies far to the west, ever at war with Arcadia. Heedless of the kingdoms caught in their midst. Dalmasca, Nebradia, Landis. Tis the small craft's fate to watch the list of the galleons and pray for light winds. Vosla, why are you here? Imagine my surprise when upon my return to Bojerba, I find both you and the Lady Ash have vanished. I thought you above consorting with Sky Pirates. Malthir is a man worthy of our trust, and it was the Lady Ash's decision. I am content to lend my arm. As I could not when Rasla died, when her throne was taken. Never again. I will defend her this time. You walk the night's path. 
The Lady Ash? We should leave this place. Let me guess. Sandstorm? Something far worse. I see, so the Tanisha does line Wraithwell's tomb. The Marquis sympathizes with your plight. The Empire watches his every move. He can keep whispers of your abduction silent for only so long. But yes, tell me, Vossler, what have you accomplished? We leave at once. This is Urutan Yensa territory, and they are unfond of visitors. Sounds like sand people. Looks like sand people. Looks like we've attracted the wrong sort of attention. Let's quit this place while we still can. Move! Vossler! Have you found the means to restore Dalmasca? First, we must claim the Dawn Shard. It all begins with that. Vossler joins the party as a guest. Alright, so... Yeah, that sounds an awful lot like sand people. The well, question is, which way do I want to go to get through here? Well, let's just go over here and see if there's any treasure first. Hello, Alron. Yeah. Although, I know that's like a flowing sea of sand, but... Huh? Well, everything dies so quickly with Fossler here. Yeah, bomb. Hello. Oh, it's a pineapple. It looks more like a bomb than a pineapple, but you know. I like how they actually give it a wick, too. Is this like a rare spawn or something? Because it might explode. It may actually kill me. I think that was like a rare monster. Alright, cool. Yeah, they were riding through that uh, sand sea on those creatures. Now, I know it's like a sea, but those fish would have had to have been vibrating at a mass frequency to be able to make it through that, like, th like that. Oh, they hit by zero, three, and one. They can't be that bad. This is an Urten Urten Yensa. Alright, so do I want to go up and over here? Oh, yes I do, I want to kill that guy. Just because he's challenging me. So while you guys are fighting that thing, I'm going to go over here and have you guys set off the... Uh... Oh, a round shield! That's what I'm wearing now. Excellent. That way leads to a dead end, but could have good treasure. So we're going to go up and check the dead end real quick. That's pretty cool, CJ. I don't have any room left on my 3DS to get that. But all the same. I'd like to get it. Ha. 
silly. Don't forget to log into Final Fantasy XI. There are two new chests that we can pick up this time. Oh, the chest just over here. Yeah, I don't have a 64 gig SD. I have like. Pack you, that's how dare I. Yeah. Hey, Pinello, you level up. Awesome. Oh, now we're on. Hello. Break my chain, but whatever. I'm not trying to chain right now. These guys look kind of like the Voth. These guys are the Voth! They're their legs. Or Noth, I guess. Everything in this game is from Final Fantasy, or... Everything in FF14 is from. <sighs> okay. Golden Amulet. That begs always the question. Double's license points earned. Ooh, I gotta get there. Treasure to use that. <laughs> Probably not. People will jack the prices up. These things are literally the NAS. Where do I want to go? This is a very long, long location. I don't want to explore all this place either. Oh, there's four of them. Hello. See you have haste on. Don't get sleep. Which is rude. I have potion.
<laughs> what? Don't lunge at me. Hey, he's got a samurai sword. He thinks he's cool. Okay, so going down that way leads to two dead ends, but there could be treasure down there, and I found the gold amulet, which gives double LP before, so it might be worthwhile to go down here just to check for treasure. And Alrin's. No treasure, just Alrin's. Hello, Marcel. That smelling salts. Most of this stream will be me running around the oil rig. So when I said that the zones in this game are massive, I wasn't kidding. I mean, look at this. That's the one way and the exit is way the hell over there. Sure, go ahead. Oh no, I wanna put me to sleep. Weird. I wanna attack Vaughn. Hey, shoot Vaughn. This could actually hurt. I should have Pinello do it. Yeah, that hurt. <laughs> oh well. But now it heals for a lot. What is what for a weapon that uh that Vaughn's using? That's a uh, bouge. I'd say uh, mace. Uh, both ears using a capella. And Pinello is using a serpent rod, I think. Yeah, chain level up. I got a must stick. Oh, that's what I'm using. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, Vosla, you miss, and Pinello comes in with the kill. Nello capitalized on that. Ah, <laughs> uh, like 300 and something usually per hit, roughly. Give or take. I'll come back and explore all this later when I need to level, probably. It's 
pretty big leveling zone. Yeah, level up. Yeah, 339. Seems to be pretty constant around 330. 360. Yeah, it, well, you know what? If the uh, Urit and Yensa didn't take kindly to us being here, I'm sure they don't take kindly to us killing them either. Oh, maybe they respect that sort of thing in their culture. Okay, that way leads out, so I'm just gonna go up here and check for treasure, because up here, in the corresponding area on the other oil rig, had my golden amulet. No worries, Marcel, no worries. Potion? Aww. That's not exciting at all. Let's look around at these oil rigs. Yeah, another chain level up. Look at that. We're up to 20. It's a level 3 chain. And treasure. Two treasure. Potion. Potion. And what are these? Dan Banias. Let's break our chain. Dead. Alright. Yes. That is right. The Nam Yansa Sansi. Where for some reason there are people here. Let's save though. Did you see that Urta and Yensa just now, Kupo? they usually a violent lot, but this one wanted help. Interested? Tell me. The Urta and Yensa are all up in a panic about a creature on the name Yensa Sansi. Their blood enemy, it seems. One of them was asking for help. An Urta and Yensa asking for help. Whatever it is, it's gotta be bad, Kupo. You look pretty strong. Maybe you could have a swing at the thing, Kupo. It's supposed to be like something like a giant tortoise. You said if you'd found some treasure at the Sand Sea, too. Why, you might be able to claim that as a reward if you're successful, Koopa. I don't know if we'll be able to kill the, uh... Kill it or not, but... Same word in both, uh, languages? That's kinda cool. Makes it easy to translate. The Nami Insistency is really a giant zone as well. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I was expecting. Ah, oh, there's sand on my boots.
Oh, it's very similar. Gotta love easy translations like that, huh? I figure I may as well kill things along the way. Add a little substance to it. Just try to just cast slow on me, you sack of shit. Uh oh. Alas, I do not know haste to remove slow yet. Oh, there is treasure over here. Good thing. I have a potion. Okay. So that's going to lead me further into the zone. Oh, silly. They're also giving away special gobby dial keys. So, another good reason to log in. Oh, there's the turtle. I don't know if I can beat this. The ur -Ten Eater has 8,000 health. It's weak to wind. I'm not in range. That missed. Go figure. Alright. Let's try casting Dark on the Ur-10 either. Oh, I did 500 damage to it. Man, Dark's awesome. Damn it. Pick the wrong one. There you go. That's what I want on. It's a very shiny shell you got there, Mr. Turtle. Sonic turn. Well, that was just rude. Here he goes again. And to stand back and hit him with arcane spells then. His defense go up? Ah, I win. The Uritan Eater has fallen. That's good. Do I go back to the Moogle? Like... Okay, give me a quick second. I'm going to run back to that Mughal. I'm not going to fight everything on the way, though. I'm just going to run past them. Maybe they'll give me treasure. Can't help if my party actually stays and kills them though. You sack of shit. I could turn their gambits off, but I'm not going to. I can't. Bl I, I don't believe I went ran this far already.
I didn't know that. I just logged in yesterday. Phonix Feta? Is that how that's pronounced? Alright, Muggle. You killed the wild scourge of the Sand Sea Kobo? Amazing! By the way, that Urten Yensa from before, he just went by Kobo. Maybe he was going to look for that treasure for you. Unusually kind of him. He was headed for the Ogre Yensa Sand Sea. I don't want to go into the Ogre Yensa Sand Sea again. So, I'm going to come back and find him later. His turtle friend was defeated, so I will be back. <laughs>